Friday shopping together, guys. Friday! Well, yeah, Friday, yeah, Friday. We always get excited for Fridays. It's one of the days that we get to let loose a little bit. We've designed a super fun workout for you today, this Friday, after this hard week of training. Okay, so before we get into the explanation of this workout, which is definitely the crutch, you need to listen to the explanation. We're going to get you warm, and then you can settle into to listening to what we're doing there. So this is going to go up. We're going to do two inch worms, followed by two dive bomb push-ups, then two broad jumps, then four inch worms, four dive bomb push-ups, four broad jumps, and then so on. We'll do six as well. So once you've done your round of six, you can chill and move into the next one. This is going to be the full body nice and warm. So, we're going to start two inch worms. Chris will do one that way, and then what he's going to do is just turn around and move in the other direction. If you've got space, you can keep on moving. Okay, or you can just do it in, in the same space. Okay, now we're going to do two dive bomber push ups. These are always tougher than they look. So, you start in that dive bomber position, and you dive bomb all the way through, shift back, and dive bomb. And push yourself back. If you can't manage the coming back, just do a normal dive bomber and then shift yourself up with your hips. Perfectly fine. The next is going to be two broad jumps. So starting in one position, you're going to dip yourself down and take a huge jump forward. Turn around and jump back. So, like I said, two of each of those, then four of each of those, then six of each of those. By then, you should be dripping with a little bit of sweat and the muscles will be ready. After this, we're going to do a little bit of accessory work before we get into the fun. And that's going to be six rounds. You're going to do one round worth of skipping, and then you're going to do 20 seconds of a side plank. So with the skipping, we'll just give you a mimic. No, actually, I've got a mimic. Yeah. Very specific, not double unders. We're just going to be doing skipping, building the rhythm in the body. So going to skip. Okay, well done, you've completed your minutes. Now you're going to go into a 20 second side plank. So, advanced option, down on the palms. Guys, this is going to be a lot of tension here. You can see Chris is already shaking. Onto the elbow, please, Chris. Or that position there will be a little bit easier. You spend 20 seconds on one side, the next round you'll spend 20 seconds on the other side. Okay, so six rounds of that, guys, getting the corner nice and fired up. Now, today's workout. We'll start with the explanation and then we'll come back to the movements. Okay. The, it's called the 10 days workout. So it follows the same process as the song 12 days of Christmas. We've got one movement that you'll do. So you'll do movement one, one rep. Then you will do movement two, two reps. Then movement one, one. Then movement three, three reps, two, one. Four, three, two, one. And each round you're going to add in another movement, okay, and do the appropriate reps. So, let's start with movement number one, which is going to be your butt slap burpee. We've done this one before, super fun, it just forces you to jump on the higher. Chris will do a burpee, and then on the way up, he's going to touch his hands above his head, and then slap his bum. Then we'll go back to doing two butt, uh, butt slap, I mean one butt slap burpees. Now we're going to do three squat jumps. Two V ups. Don't worry, I'm not going to make you do these one So two V ups, one butt slap burpee. And now we'll go to the next exercise, which will be four jack knife setups. Now we're not going to make Chris carry on doing all of those reps, we're just carry on demoing them for you now, just so you understand. So, jack knife setups, one, two, three, four. We go on to a handstand hold, guys. So we'll show the edited version first. This is going to be feet on a chair, and you're going to hold this position for five, four, three, two, one. Alternatively, if you are more, more advanced, you can do this against the wall, okay, and hold that for five seconds. Great job. The next movement is going to be a plyo lunge, which we're going to do six of. So that's going to be jumping lunges. 
One, two, three, four, five, six. If you can't do the jumping lunges, guys, we're just going to have you step for the day. More than enough work getting done. Good job. The next movement, seven tricep push-ups, which is going to be a diamond push-up. These are always fun, they blow up the arms. Good work. Or in place of that, you can do some dips on a chair. Straight legs to make it harder, bent legs to make it easier. This is turning into a workout for Chris, guys. He must come in here. You know, he does this day in and day out for you guys. So, what we've got next is mountain climbers. This is going to be the big movement. We're going to jump in the legs out. One, two, three, four. Good job. Reverse to sit up. So, we're going to be flat on the floor. We're bringing the knees up to the chest and then shooting the feet up into the sky. There we go. Good job. You'll be doing nine of those. And lastly, guys, in your last round when you end at the top, is 10 Cossack squats. It's going to be five per side, nice and simple. Pushing the hips back, keeping the weight on this outside push all the time, the heel flat on the ground. Good job. So like I said, guys, a nice bit of fun for this Friday, gearing you up for the weekend. We hope you've had a great week. Um, we'll see you tomorrow in the wonderful workout. Subscribe. Subscribe. Subscribe.